all right so what is going on today youtube we got a brand new zombie tuner coming out um which is the name of shinobi necro now i don't know if this has to do with the structure deck or anything like that but i'm pretty sure they would give us a you know tuner on itself because a level two tuner and uh <clears throat> damn i don't know what the hell just happened it sounded like i was a computer just now but uh, a level two tuner and a level seven synchro it's it's a little like eh, i mean we don't have too many level five zombies and the only level five zombies you really do have is uh endless decay and most of the vampire stuff um so i don't know i'm not sure why it's a level two um i was reading the comments of uh, house of champs video uh and it was um somebody commented hey man it definitely should have been a level three because that would have you know made it a ton a lot better and i, I totally agree and um yeah and also there's another thing i do want to comment on uh why does every time uh the vendred or the two card extra link combo or the extra link deck with zombies come up everybody always has some type of snarky comment with like to to, to basically like a backhanded compliment like i was reading through the comments because i you know i wanted to see whatever which you guys were pretty much well not it's not my fans but i just want to see what the community is talking about seeing my guy billy williams in there talking about some zombies and stuff and he was talking about like the somebody was mentioning like a sh sh shooting doji seraph knight combo stuff like that and it's like they were talking about oh you go plus three or something but this is an even my guy billy williams commented on that and stuff like that and uh what's the name? i was just reading through the comments and then like somebody said oh well this th how does this fit in the uh zombie um the zombie actually it, oh, it doesn't fit because you don't you know in the two card actually deck you really don't need this card it's not really it doesn't really do anything and then the first comment is oh i haven't topped anything and that's from the house of champs and i'm like what like how is this supposed to top anything that hasn't been any read like the first regionals are just coming up this saturday like how is it supposed to top anything like how is it summon sources just became legal like it, it's that's like it's weird it's weird and he's not the only person there's multiple people like there's doing like but if like, if you just take any type of any type of research you can go play the deck your damn self and you would understand like the deck is not like it's oh you need solitaire pre prep no you, you literally can do it with two zombies it does not need to be you can do it with uh mizuki in a solitaire you can do it with, not, not Miz yeah mizuki in a solitaire you can do it you can do it with any you can do it with a ritual summon slayer and any zombie you can literally do it multiple multiple ways that's just the easiest less card advantage i mean the less cards you need basically in your hand to do it and i'm not understanding like why like i understand gokis has been going off this whole time but they need two cards also like i i, I okay you know i i just don't understand it, it's just it maybe it irks me because maybe you know i have a personal i guess tied to it and stuff like that um but it's just weird like it's 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 always it's just so weird that every time the vendors come up like any other two card combo any other deck comes up oh this is great this is that but as soon as it's the vendred stuff like i'm not sure what it is but it's always some snarky comment it's always a backhanded something just always something i'm like that's like why like there's there's no reason for that but once again we're not gonna get on that but i wanted to get on it <laughs> you get what i'm saying you guys let me know do you guys see that all the time like it's it's very weird it's, it's very very weird but let's go ahead and get into the card. Sorry for that. But let's go ahead and get to the card. So it is a level two dark zombie, 800 attack, zero defense. Uh, the first effect of a zombie monster other than this card is special summon from the graveyard. While this card is already faced up, you can draw one and discard a card. And then two, if this card is banished from the graveyard to either activate or buy a card effect, you can special summon this card and banish it when it leaves the field. Um, yeah. Um, like, like the comment said, uh, in the current version of zombies, basically the most competitive version which is the extra link what well, i i believe to be the most competitive version and stuff like that the extra link version you don't need this it can definitely be helpful because it does draw and discard a card so excuse me but that also uh helps out the deck because you can thin your deck out pretty much by two i mean not not by two cards but you can thin your deck out you can d get rid of cards you don't want you, can, you know you can probably draw into the cards you need um I, I i think it's a cool effect i think it's a cool effect now the the only thing that really kind of bothers me with this is that the second effect the fact that it has to be banished from the graveyard and then it banishes itself when it leaves the field it should have been more of you just if you banish it from the graveyard you can special summon it that's just to have been the end of it like it does not need to have like they just cut this part off this card would have been fine on its own but 
um like i said it, it it's a decent card i would give it like a seven out of ten six out of ten uh I'm going towards that route because it really it really takes a lot of setup to get this card and now unless we get some new stuff this is going to take a lot of setup to actually put on the field and then like you have like i thought this was special summit when you special summon a zombie like you know but like it's like what the like, sucker is the same exact thing but it's a link monster i, I don't know um, this one is not a link monster, so I mean you have to basically get this on the board and already have other setup. Like with Sucker, you already have stuff going because you already used two zombies to go into Sucker, and Sucker already has the built-in effect to special summon from your opponent's graveyard to uh, basically to your opponent's field. So that also can uh, trigger the effect. So that's good. Um, this card right here, man, is just okay. I already have some combos in my head and stuff like that that you can definitely do with this. I, it's like a, the, the best one I think I've came up with is a three card combo. And um, I'm trying to get it down to two. But um, yeah, like I said, uh, I don't know if uh, I believe Billy wins with Comet. I think uh, uh, I don't know why I keep saying your full name, but yeah, I think Billy he uh, commented on like so somebody said, yeah, somebody said it, the shoot, shoot and doji thing. Um, I believe that's a three card. I think that's Brilliant Fusion, Shooting Doji, and Solitaire. But the one I came up with was Pre Prep, this card, and a Solitaire. We can tribute Solitaire, go Unizombie, send Mizuki, and then ditch this card from our hand. So now Unizombie's level five. Pre Prep, get the Slayer, activate Origin, banish this, banish the two star, and then banish a Solitaire, Special Summon Slayer. This will trigger Special Summon itself. Then you can go uh, Vampire Sucker. Search Evolution, Dump Battle Lord, Activate Evolution, Special Summon Battle Lord. This will trigger and Sucker will trigger. So you go draw two, discard one, and then, you know, call monsters. And then you can, you know, go on a West name. Make this is the level six. So, then, I mean, since this is the level two tuner, what you can then do is get, uh, what's the name? Goblin Zombie. And then, or you can get Mizuki. Wait, you still have the Mizuki in the graveyard, right? Do we still have the Mizuki in the graveyard? I think we do. Yeah, we actually still have the Mizuki in the graveyard, and so then with that, you can either get um, you can either get Goblin Zombie or you can get actually yeah you can get Goblin Zombie synchro into a Stardust Charge where draw another card so that Sucker Necro and and, and Stardust Charge where draw three you can use Mizuki to get the Slayer then you can go into uh, Beatrice and send the the the, the other the the other world Banshee get a zombie world and then next turn yeah see look there you go so that's pretty much a three card combo that replaces itself and don't forget battle lord still adds and sends so you can actually do more you can do a lot more um yeah so hmm and then yeah because we can send strategies and then strategies can come back and we can synchro those two off and then we can go into a herald and then we could yeah we can use um we can do a lot we can do a lot Yo, that's actually pretty decent. I don't know. We might have to test with this. But, um, yeah, that's just a simple combo I came up with in my head. And I started ad-libbing towards the end. But, yeah, you guys already can see this card is decent. Um, like I said, uh, it doesn't really fit the deck. Like I said, we have to see what other cards we get in the extra deck. Not in the extra deck, but in the, uh, the structure deck. But, uh, yeah, besides that, I think, you know, it's, it's a cool card. Like I said, 6, 7 out of 10. Uh, maybe that's a little too high, but... It's, it's, it's a cool card for me. You guys let me know your thoughts down below. Um, if you guys haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. If you have not, if you want to help the channel, links are in the description down below. Um, and also, you guys can click and add. Either or is fine with me. Thank you guys very much for watching. I will see you guys later today with a the, the second duel.